pad and you think that sounds crazy. Uh, as we are forecasting highs in the 50s tomorrow, to be <laughs> fair. Uh, but yeah, by the weekend, we'll kind of point things in the right direction. 72 on Saturday with some sun. Southwest breezes 10 to 20 miles per hour. 77 on Sunday. Southwest winds then 15 to 25 miles per hour. But we are on tap for a milder weekend in the 70s. Your Wednesday, though, well, it's in the 50s this morning. It's already a bit breezy with winds from the south, 10 to 15 miles per hour. Temperatures will peak midday in the mid 60s, and then with maybe a couple of stray light showers at times this afternoon will likely drop down closer to 60 degrees by 4 p.m. The wind will be strongest this afternoon, and then as we head into this evening, it's still blustery, uh, but we are cooling off into the 50s. The gusts 25 miles per hour this morning, 40 miles per hour this afternoon. There's a wind advisory in place for all of us from 11 a.m. until 8 p.m. And even this evening and tonight, still a couple of lingering 30 mile per hour gusts. Here's future cast. Yeah, we do have the chance of a stray sprinkle this morning. Chance of a passing light shower midday through the afternoon. We'll expect to see more clouds certainly than we saw yesterday, uh, but by sunset 7 p.m. All this moisture is already well out to our east. That's round one and it should be on the light side. Round two tomorrow comes alongside some colder air, so some snow showers continue to fly up in the mountains tomorrow and we'll have these scattered about light showers. That chance though will linger on into Thursday evening. Uh, the big story, though, I think is going to be the fact that temperatures, which are in the 50s now, will hit the mid 60s today and then drop down to near 40 tonight. But tomorrow, we probably won't get out of the upper 50s. That's almost 20 degrees colder than average here for the tail end of March. Friday, last day of the month, we're 67. Uh, we flip the calendar on April the 1st on Saturday and no fooling at 72, 77 Sunday, and then a dip back to the 60s early next week. Back to the news desk. Justin, thank you. Well, a lot of us are planning our summer.